Hey there folks, this is GreenyXI, welcoming you right back to Let's Play Shadow Hearts 3. This is episode 24. In the last episode, we started the cave, the Atua cave, in order... Atua... Did I pronounce that right? <laughs> anyway, it's the place where we got the first ring of the two to seal the gate. And then we got the second gate by going to Nathan's place, the Grand Canyon. And we also did a bit more side questy stuff with Mao. And we found out that we can't really do the fight that opened up to us now. <laughs> But we'll do that later, why not? Make it a bit easier. So what we're going to be doing today, a bit of a change of plan from what I said last time. We're going to be getting the UMA for Nathan. It might, all, it might be all we can do today, but it's something. So this is the UMA we were given. Uh, the right involves placing items of corresponding colours around a coloured statue in a cave. And we've seen all the coloured statues. And then finally offering gold on the altar to summon the monster and be blessed. So, uh, so we're going to have to do multiple... You ready? Ito Cave. Okay, <laughs> I did pronounce it wrong. <laughs> so I'm going to keep Nathan on us all the way through just so we can always see the, the meat symbols, the UMA symbols. <sighs> okay. So the black the black um, tokens, tiki, tika statues, are still... Tiki statues <laughs> are still... Uh, they still deactivated. Okay, I don't understand how we're meant to start this, though. Like, if it takes too long, because it's such a big cave, I might end up just googling. Okay. So, I mean... Let's just... Should we try up this way? I think this led to blue tiki statues, didn't it? It will do. But if we're looking for... Ah, here we go. Set the trap at a blue one. It said the right colour sort of thing. The morpho scales are blue. I, I had a look. <laughs> okay, so that's them done. Right, so next up... Hmm... Come on, let's keep going further into the cave. Okay... I'm thinking, like, we didn't see... It's only one other option if we didn't see black. If we didn't see the black tiki's uh, having the, the meat option at the start of the dungeon. There were only one other set of black tiki's that we saw, and there were three in a row. So I think getting those out of the way now might be the way to go. No, not that way, then. I know we turn left somewhere to get to them, don't we? Okay. Oh, I wanted to do this today. I'm recording all of this dungeon and stuff in one go today. I wanted to get it done. Just get out of the way, because the enemies in this place are a bit of a nightmare. But at least we found these guys. Okay, where's it to? It's gotta be around here. Yeah! So, black. Black was the maiden's hit. I think that's referring to like typical Japanese folklore kind of thing. You know, ja Japanese hair. <laughs> Whatever. Let's check the map. That's something I've never done in this place. <laughs> I think we're going... Right, we'll go up here this time. To the top. Yeah, because it's where we saw the red ones that teleported us to near the exit, wasn't it? So... <sighs> okay. So, yeah, the red one can go you. Wherever it was. Was it over you? Yeah, it was. Good. <laughs> Good. Um. No? Not what I was thinking of? I don't know where else to go. Um. Okay. Like I said, if I was, if I got stuck, I was gonna do a. Um, I was gonna do a Google. I will. I'm gonna do a quick Google because I don't want to be running around with these enemies that take a long time. <laughs> All right, I've I've had a look. I am so sorry. <laughs> and I think it's there in the middle. I can't remember if we even came down here. I don't think we did. Oh no, we got this far, and then I never went any other way. Let's try down this way then. Nope. 
But it's the other side of that, so that's good to know. It'll be a shortcut back out, maybe. I'm not sure where we're going. Red, oh, red. Is that the trap? That's grapefruit. Pinky red. I do want to go on that teleporter, but I want to see what's down this way first. Oh, okay. Let's try the teleporter. See, there's no other colour tiki left, is there? But this led to the treasure chest that we couldn't find before, or I couldn't find before, whatever. Blood loss too. Oh, not much good, but at least I, I've had it now. Right, so, let's check the map, where we to? I think we need to go... According to Google, we need to go to where we fought the boss. Which I think is very weird. Because I'm not sure why. But that's what it is. Okay, <laughs> let's, let's start heading back again then. We're back by here. Of course we are, we teleported. <laughs> that freaked me the shit out then. So, where do we go from here then? Up here, yeah? No, 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 no. It's down the right way. Ah, oh, God. Awkward, awkward dungeon. But at least we got that treasure chest time. That's what I wanted. Right, so that's going to be a blue one. We need to get a red to get on the other side, yeah? So we'll have to go over the bridge. The, the map's really handy. Like, I don't know why I haven't been using them. Because if you use the, the maps, you can see where dead ends are. Or maybe not so much in this place because they don't show what, where the blue tiki's are. But otherwise, you know, you can see where treasure chests are coming. If there's dead ends. So we have to go all the way around, don't we? We need to go up. Right. Up to that one? Yeah, up to that red. Okay, we're nearly there. I've been using a few more spells because we're not looking for all the treasure chests. And they're doing really well against enemies, speeding things up a little bit. Not a whole lot, but, you know, a little bit. What's in there? That's the black one. You know, if it wasn't for Scan, I... Or Snap, I don't think I would even use Johnny. He's not bad, but he's not great at anything. Unless I'm using him wrong. But then, I haven't been doing his side quest, so <laughs> that don't help. Right, okay. We're on, the, we're on the right track. To the grand finale of the side quest, and essentially, hopefully, this dungeon. So what I'm going to do... I am going to use a tent. Save. Because I don't want to have to do all that again. You can imagine. Dying now, after doing all that and not saving. Oh. Let's head on in. Go to the party I want. Ugh. Okay, in we go. Right, we didn't actually have a... Oh, we did have a chance to look around you. Of course we did. There's just a massive monster in the middle. Oof. Right, here we go. Right, is it white or gold? Gold or gotta be. Here it comes. Oh my god. I'm so glad. Hands invisible. Come on. Snap it up. <laughs> this might be a bit of a tricky fight just because we got we got like Hilda who's low health and Nathan who is definitely well, not that low health looking at him but defense seems to be a bit low. Might be my fault. Right, so we need to use wind. Come on then Nathan. You are perfect for this. What sort of height is he? Middle or low? Rabbit shot. Oh, close. We don't get much opportunity to use Nathan's sort of gun moves. So I don't use him very often. Okay, that was amazing. Uh, Gale Vortex. No, it's not high enough. Um, just attack for now. Damn it. We could fuse. I guess we could fuse. Thunderbird. Thunderbirds are go. Alright, we'll just attack. Magic is just not that good in this game. <laughs> Usually.
That was some damage, man. He is a proper boss. Okay, keep on attacking. You, you are going to... Mm, cure plus, go on then. 24 MP is a lot for a bit of healing, but it should fully heal at this point, I think. Yeah. Yeah, nearly. Nick is getting better strength wise, mind. Like, he's. I think it's because I've always had him under level that he's been. behind. And now he's got three attacks on his judgment ring. Wow. It's a lot of damage against Nathan as well because earth and wind, you know, alternating uh, elements. You, you can raise up. I want Nathan to be alive at the end of it. I want him to get some EXP. And Johnny, you... Yeah, just cure him up a bit. And attack. I wish we would just be teleported out to this dungeon, but I get a sneaking suspicion I'm going to have to walk back out again. Ooh, paralysis. That's not good. At least he was used against Nate. <laughs> that sounds bad, but it's true. Uh, yeah. Paralyzed. Paralysisized. <laughs> you. You know what you're doing. Back up. Bollocks. Oh, he's still alive. That's good. I think we should be able to finish this boss off now. Oh, definitely. 32 health left. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Harder than I thought it would be for, like, a side quest boss. But not too bad. Hey. <laughs> Alright. Party. Um, party. Battle team, that's the one. Uh, take out Nathan. I think I'll put Mao out to get back out to you. Level her a bit for her side quest. I'll see you at the entrance. Oh, no. I'll see you back at Grand Canyon. We made it back. It wasn't too bad coming back, so you could go through the blue tiki's and there was a red teleporter that took it back to the entrance. So it wasn't so bad coming back, as I thought it would be. And Mao did level up, and Johnny, but... You know, stuck shell powered up. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Haven't heard any rumors of others, but is that a loading thing? I'm gonna leave and come back in. It's normally like when you do a new dungeon or every couple of dungeons, so I can't imagine there is a new one yet. Okay, that's it then. So I think, yeah, you know what? We'll do another 10 minutes or something. We'll get to maybe the first save point in the next place, in the tower where we need to use the rings. So yeah, let's do that now. Let's head on in. Because I would like to make a start. That felt like a big side quest and no progress. So let's try it. A Yunu Salt Lake. Man, how long do we have to wait? Stupid thing. Maybe if I just smashed it open. <clears throat> the fact 
that things are taking so long means one thing. None of this was a product of my imagination. This is bad. They somehow manage to find the other power, and then they figure out how to use it, then... Hey, what are you mumbling about? Are you talking about those kids again? Uh, don't worry. It's nothing to get all upset over, really. Just something I'm thinking I have to do, with the gate not opening and all. What? <laughs> if you know what's going on, then tell me now! This standing around here is getting on my nerves! <laughs> Once in an ancient text, I came across a worrisome passage. It told about some ruins located at a lake called Uyuni. And those ruins actually contained a blue light, which was meant to oppose the gate of the red light. You see? <laughs> a blue light? Is that what's keeping the gate closed? That could be it, yes. It is possible. And if the blue light were somehow to be freed from the ruins, there's a chance that the gate might even be destroyed completely. If the gate is destroyed, what about Lady's wish? Her wish? Why, it would remain ungranted. This is serious. Where are you going, Mr. Killer? I'm gonna go destroy those ruins at Uyuni. Or wherever. Those runts aren't going to interfere anymore. My, my. He certainly seems upset, doesn't he? <laughs> Why he even left Lady and me all alone? <laughs> but at this point, I wouldn't even think of laying so much as a finger on my dear Lady. If she can just open that gate, finally... All my dreams will come true. Okay. Are we actually going to be able to kill off Killer this time? Oh, that's stunning. Genuinely really nice. Looks like ice, but salt. Watery ice. <laughs> Melting ice? <laughs> the ring lit up. Aha. One ring lit up, so one to get in, one to do something at the top, is it? I don't know, I'm guessing. All I can think of, though, is Tales of Symphonia with Lloyd in his ring. But, you know, things happen all the time. What do we do? Oh, we can go through the middle. Okay. I wasn't sure if we'd be able to. For some reason, I'm thinking there'll be uh, sliding puzzles, but they're nice. It just feels like it. Hey, resist. Getting a lot of them lately. Let's check you guys out. Trampled over sweet girl's dreams. I'll come at a place. <laughs> what? <laughs> Lady? Is that what it means? No. Oh. Uh, what have we got you? And I guess some of them. I don't know why I want them. I don't want them. They're not enough anymore. Uh, pure leaves, pure seed, pure root. Right now, pure seeds are fine, I think. No, we'll get some of them. Benedictions, go on, couple. I'm just rounding them up a bit. Yeah, new equipment. We haven't had any for a while. We're gonna go for a lot. Hopefully, I don't mess it up because God knows. Oh, Kakashi doll. I might just get one. Let's just buy it. We can always sell the other one. It's a waste of money still, but you know. Uh, Dominator, the Dominator guitar. Ah, better armor too. It has been a while, right? Uh, one, two, three. I might just get all physical defense ones. Yeah, go on. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. What? I haven't got enough money. We'll have to. We'll have to get these and see what happens from there. Yeah! Just about. Rank B! Oh, nice! We did spend a lot of money, mind. How many have we got? Five. Six, seven. Yeah, go on. 
Oh, I can't believe we got that. Right, okay, so we got some really good stuff. Not the best accessories for, like, status boosts, but it'll do for now, I think. Anything else good, yeah? Little power? Cancels out SP lowering, okay. That might be worth getting a couple of when we get to the final boss or something, we play some up men. Maybe. Let's equip it all. Really good stat upgrades, which means maybe we can do the mouse next side quest. Maybe it's good enough for that. This is armor and weapon, so. We're not going to go out yet. I can't be asked for that, but, uh, yeah. I'm hoping that's a burn a waste. I haven't seen anything to do with, like, a doll. But, it might be coming up. Yeah, that'll do. We saved a lot of money, and we spent it. What more do you want? Ah, chest chest. Pure extract, okay. Where do we... Ah, there's a door over there, just so... Oh, oh, okay. Might as well have a fight then. Oh, a Halapus. We saw some of them before, didn't we? Somewhere. We still got Mao in the party. I didn't intend for that. Well, whatever. We're stuck with him, with her for this fight now. Just do some damage to that. Shit. <laughs> and then miss again. That was definitely an amazing smile. 130 HP. Do some damage to the flying one. She wouldn't have killed off uh, the little guy anyway. Probably. On the other hand, hopefully... Uh, Shania can. Yeah, she can. She always can. She's amazing. Oh, 92 damage. Okay. Snap Salagi. <laughs> I just find it funny every time. I can't help it. Oh, another one. Okay. Ichio. Oh, how much else did he have? Can't see the max health now. I think about 220 to 250 looking at the bar. Oh, him again. <laughs> oh, about 500 HP, if not more. A little bit over 500 HP. That's pretty shocking. But we've got new weapons, so... Yeah. And we'll have Frank in the party to start the next episode. I am going to try Cat's Bow. And see what coins we get out of this thing. Maybe it'll be the next level up, you know? The highest level of coin, I think. It is, isn't it? It is water type this time. Like, I remember the last, um... The last enemy of this kind. Different colouring, but this kind. Was sort of... Was light, I think. But even though it looked watery like this one does, I think it was light. Oh, that was close. Much health? 100. It's a water type move. Let's just queue up Slim Hilda for now. I want to do a little bit more damage to it, just in case. Intentionally miss. Which, if it's like the other games, where if you miss, uh, you get that whole sort of... At, at the end of the game, you get that whole sort of ranking screen based on how many times you hit perfect misses and things like that, I think. Yeah. So, that's going to go a bit lower now, because of my intentional misses to get the coins. <laughs> I've done it quite a bit. 80, 170 down. Three scallop coins, so we're still on scallop. Okay. 
3,000 odd EXP, mind. Alright, so that'll do it. We've seen what sort of place this is going to be. I'm not going to use another tent. I nearly did then. <laughs> I, oh, I like Mao though. I think, you know, I think I will keep Mao in the party instead of Hilda for now. No, not Ricardo. Sorry, wrong one. Uh, Frank, there we go. Although Ricardo is falling behind, so maybe we should think of using him a little bit more. Yeah, that'll do it, won't it? And we can queue her in between fights with Hilda. Yeah, and then once we get near the top, or what looks like the top, I can switch out Hild uh, Mao for Hilda. Yeah, there we go. So, this has been Greeny XI. Hope you've enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again in a bit. When we go for... I can't remember the name of the tower. Come on, come on, show me, show me. Well, you need Salt Lake, but there wasn't into the tower as well, no. Oh, we've we've been playing for a day, <laughs> twenty-four hours. Ah, I don't know where the plot's gonna go after this, because there's no way I can see it going unless the gate opens. Mm. Anyway, thanks again for watching, folks. See you again in a bit.